G'day, what's up guys? Welcome to the next episode in our Skyrim series. In the previous episode, we started, well, we continued the Dark Brotherhood. It's kind of started, uh, long story short. Uh, we killed a bunch of people that we needed to, all these three guys. Uh, and then we've taken up a contract uh, to go and speak to Miriri. So, yeah. Have some sound? Let's get straight down to it. Where is Muriri? Can't really pronounce his name. Mu Mu Ma Eri Mu Eri. Yeah, I don't know. All I know is I am keen to chop some people up in game. Why are you looking at me like that? The Dark Brother. Oh, oh, I. My goodness, you're really here. The Black Sacrament. It actually worked. What I need... What I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. I didn't know it when we were... with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. They're holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Raldbathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. Excellent. We'll kill them all. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. That was my toes cracking, by but, the way. I didn't fart. Well, there is one more thing. If you're interested. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsine Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsine dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Why is she, why is she squatting? I planned to kill Elaine myself, you know. Nilsine too. It lost my nerve. I even brewed a special poison, lotus extract. Maybe you could use it. Just mm. coat your weapon with it. Then you get you know the what? idea. Bow and arrows, you know, may not be the the worst Maybe way to like assassinate people. Me. I didn't think about that. In uh, yesterday's episode, I was trying to, you know, figure out what the best way to kill someone would be, and I just kind of walked up to him and attacked him, and everyone started attacking me. But yeah, that would that would work. All right, time to get another bounty on our head since I don't really um, have high archery. Take out the optional mission first, and then we'll go kill the other guy. I feel like we're born for this kind of quest line. I look forward to something more like this in uh, Elder Scrolls Six. What is it? are they not in here? gonna leave town. I'm fine slaying a few guards, but By the water of the yard. Stop right there. Oh. Here we go. Yeah, I don't mind taking out a few guards, but outside the city is better. Less guards. Okay, let's go find the other guy. Seems like we've already been here. Oh, 
Imagine this guy just like rolling up to a camp, dual wielding a mace and uh, like two Daedric weapons. Just slaying through your your forces one by one, just unstoppable. Like a terminator. walks through the fire. Because we're a master thief, we also can... I, that reminds me, before we end off this series, we've got to finish the Thieves Guild. I keep forgetting that I haven't finished that technically. Life in the void. What are these guys got? Hello. Master Lock. Key. The best thing to get. I am just here. Why would I even want to come up here? Like, in fact, like I could have just walked the other way. Why was that a master lock? Seems really unnecessary to come up here. Oh. Oh, she just came through the I door. Okay, what's through here? Mission is done here, but we just like chaos. Okay, that I'm not gonna mess with. Those things hurt, they killed me once. Mostly because I underestimated how strong they were. This is an exit. where we should be. Oh, 
pretty sure I've been here for like another minute. Taking some damage. Oh yeah, we have been here. We started like all the way up there, I think, and slowly made our way down. I think. Let's start heading out. We'll go turn in this contract, get some more people to meet. Really, we got really sidetracked here. Is that a little spider still chasing us? Nope. Now it's gonna be potentially tricky turning this in because we're wanted in so many different regions, but we'll try. I don't think we're wanted in Markov yet. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Well, what news? Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. And I heard about Nilsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please, take this. As payment and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget you. Wonder what the ring does. My father, Klepper, is the one you... Yeah. Not something we would use. I yeah. work silver, like my father. And his father... the next mission gonna be ah you're back so of course dear of course and from what my little ravens tell me you handled yourself quite well now I need your assistance with a matter of a more personal nature it's Cicero Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. So you understand my fear. If Cicero's planning something and conspiring with one of our own, it would be disastrous. Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber 
and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. They'll never think to check it. Who in their right mind would hide inside? Now go, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. Well, this is Kill something. Well and Where do we need to go with, uh, with this? Oh, in there. Okay. It's only a novice lock. Wild. Disturb us. Everything is going according to plan. The others, I've spoken to them, and they're coming around, I know it. The wizard Festus Crex, <laughs> perhaps even the Argonian, and the Unchild. What about you? Hmm? Have you. have you spoken to anyone? No? No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. And what do you do? Hmm? Nothing! Not... Not that I'm angry. No, oh, never. Cicero understands. <laughs> Cicero always understands. And obeys. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Poor Cicero. Dear Cicero. Such a humble servant. But he will never hear my voice. For he is not the listener. Oh, but how can I defend you? How can I exert your will if you will not speak to anyone? Oh, but I will speak. I will speak to you. For you are the one. Yes, you. You who shares my iron tomb. Who warms my ancient bones. I give you this time. Journey to Warren Road. Speak with Armand Mortier. Poor Cicero has failed you. Poor Cicero is sorry, sweet mother. I've tried so very hard. But I just can't find the listener. Tell Cicero the time has come. Waiting for all these years. Darkness rises when silence dies. What? What treachery? Defiler, debaser, and defiler! You have violated the sanctity of the Night Mother's coffin! Explain yourself! Speak, worm! She spoke to you? More treachery. More trickery and deceit. You lie. The Night Mother speaks only to the listener. And there is no listener! She... She said that. She said those words. To you, darkness rises when silence dies. 
But those are the words, the binding words, written in the keeping tomes. The signal so I would know, mother's only way of talking to sweet Cicero. Then, it's true, she's back. Our lady is back. She has chosen a listener. She has chosen you! <laughs> All hail the listener! <laughs> this guy's such a weirdo. By Sithis, this ends now! Back away, fool! Whatever you've been planning is over! Are you alright? I heard the commotion. Who was Cicero talking to? Where's the accomplice? Reveal yourself, traitor! I spoke only to the Night Mother. I spoke to the Night Mother, but she didn't speak to me. Oh, no! She spoke only to him, to the listener. What? The listener? What are you going on about? What is this lunacy? It's true. It's true. The Night Mother has spoken. The silence has been broken. The listener has been chosen. When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared the worst. Are you all right? Then what in Sithis' name is going on? Cicero spoke to the Night Mother, but she spoke to you. Is this just more of the fool's rambling? What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body? And the Night Mother who, according to everything we know, will only speak to the person chosen as listener, just spoke. Right now. To you? By Sithis. And? What did she say? Amand Motier? I have no idea who that is. But Valenrude. That I have heard of. And I know where it is. Hmm. No. No. Listen. I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? The Night Mother may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I will not have my authority so easily dismissed. I... I need time to think about all this. Go see Nazir. Do some work for him. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. All right, well, we do need to turn in a couple of missions to Nazir. That's still at the dinner table. Will there ever... Of course she is. I could do this all day. Here's your payment. Good. And I hope you were careful in that lumber mill. Those splinters and... Your payment. For a job well done. Congratulations. You slaughtered an emaciated beggar in cold blood. You are truly an opponent to be feared. Here's your payment. Well then, your timing couldn't be better. As it turns out, I've got two new contracts. One rather easy assignment and another that should prove quite a challenge. Your first target is an orc bard named Lurbuk. An orc? The other is a hmm. vampire by the name of Hearn. Happy hunting. I need to... Good luck. And try not to get yourself killed. Get some blood from an orc, so that's convenient. Me? I've been on the dark brother. Alright guys, that's where we're going to end up the episode. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying the Dark Brotherhood storyline. If you have, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. Plenty more Skyrim content to come. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye! Regular gaming. Regular gaming. Regular gaming.